What's going on guys? Welcome back. I hope everybody's having a great day. All right guys, I got a Martian photo for you, but this one is very difficult for several reasons. One, it's a very small photo. Two, it's very dark. Sometimes we know why they do that because they want to hide what's in the photo. So what they do is they, you know, either blur or whatever they need to do and then they dock in the photo and, you know, can almost pull nothing out of it. And three, it's low res. <laughs> surprise, surprise. But can we get anything out of this photo? Let me show you the photo I'm talking about. All right, you can find it right here. It's Sol 3004, so it's two days ago. And you see right nav cam gives you the information here. The image was taken by nav cam right or the nav right uh, on board NASA's Mars rover Curiosity on Sol 2004. And you can see it right here, January 2021. It was actually the 17th. So again, a couple of days ago, 423. So you can hit right here, download. Of course, you guys will get the link. You'll see it here. Um, and this is what you get. This is the photo, guys. This is supposed to be a hundred percent. Wow, that's small. So again, small photo, very dark, and low res trash. And you know what happens when you zoom into a low res, right? You know what I mean. All right, so let's max out the zoom on this and see what we can find. Still hard to find anything. Now there's a couple things right here in the lower right corner, right here. These two mounds, and I don't think they're mounds at all. We'll have a closer look at that. And on the left-hand side, guys, if you can, take your magnifiers now, pause this, look at the very left lower corner, all the way to the side of this mound, this first mound, and you see what looks like a couple objects. This one, in general, it appears to be off the ground. and has a little shadow under it. And you'll notice over here to the left of that, there's actually lines in this, whatever this area is, and you'll notice there's actually a small circle, like a design, if you will. Okay, so again, pause it, have a quick look, and then let's jump into this. Here's the Photoshop. This is what it should look like right here. Very, very small, and even though that's 25%, this is now still 25%, because you can see in the lower left corner. Now have a look with your magnifiers. Now this is much bigger. I'm going to go ahead and bring that up. Let's just zoom in here a bit more. Have a look at this photo. Again, look at all in this area here, and this will just be in gray, and which is fine. Right here. Okay. Look at the small details in here. You'll see what looks like these lines here. Line here. And you'll notice right below this arrow, there's a small round circle, like a design. Okay. Here. This is the thing that intrigued me because it appears to be off the ground. It almost looks like it has a shape like this here. There's some kind of line there, some kind of dark detail in here. What look like lines. There's another line going like this. And check out the actual shadow just below it. Now, you might say, well, I don't really see it. You will. Not not great, but you'll see it. Now, let's, let's bounce over here real quick to the right. You'll see this right here. This is interesting because this, this part right here, appears to be doing this. And it almost looks like there's a pipe sticking out of this thing. And you'll see what I mean in a moment. Okay. It's pretty cool. Here, there's something right here. You can see it doing this. There's a line like this. And then this is completely blurred out. Really can't make up too much in there. So let's get into this. Let's jump into this one here to begin with. You can see right here. Something's here. It doesn't look natural, whatever that is. And we can't make out what it is, and that's fine. All right, so let's bounce over to the left-hand side on these mounds and have a better look at that. Okay, so here's these mounds. So all I do is brought up the exposure, and this is what you get. Now, I did use the burn tool to see if I can find anything. Just look at some of the, the pieces in here, guys. It's just things that look like they're going off in different directions. Is it nothing more than a manipulation? That's a possibility. Here, these areas in here. Here's that little pipe thing I showed you earlier. It goes like this. Nice edges. It appears to almost be doing this. Okay. See that? I'm going to take the lines away. And there you go. All right. Now, let's bounce over to the left. 
And guys, this is what really caught my eye because I'm going to go into full enhancement. And again, I can see this right here with ease. It has this round design. This thing's going like this, and it kind of goes around that, comes back around. And there's other lines and striations what look like something is intelligently made here. Now we have this object right here. This to me is more intriguing than anything. This thing is neat because I can see the actual shape or this thing doing this. Actually, that should have been more slanted down like that. This is going down like this. It appears to have something along the lines like this. You can see something just like that standing and there's a shadow underneath this thing. But this thing also goes like this. You can see the line going like this. And there's a very faint line right there. I don't know if you guys can see that. Let's zoom into this a little better. Have a close look at that right there. Really, really odd. I can see shapes in there I should not see. And again, look at the actual weird lines in this within this circle. Look at this. This is cool. Then it faded and it goes away. There's some kind of darker area here. And I can see this doing like this. It looks to have some kind of weird stand, and like I said, with a shadow underneath it. Okay? See that? Again, look at the lines. They're there. And this is the original photo, guys, right here. This is the small one. This is the large one. I haven't done anything to it right here. This is completely stock. Now, it is trash. The photo's trash. I get that. But we can also bring stuff out on this, and we're going to try our damnedest to do that. So... Let me show you the fully enhanced, and we'll have a look. Let's do a little blur first. Guys, check out the lines in here. This is what I was talking about earlier. Again, we have this what looks like a straight line. Come down like this. Looks like it does this. has this round piece here. All their straight lines in here. You can see these. Okay. It's one thing to have a straight line. You say, well, maybe laid rocks in a mountain. I get that. It makes perfect sense to me. This does not. This doesn't make sense at all. We've got other items up here in the background. They look like they appear to be sticking out of said hillside or whatever. It looks like this has like a small dome or some kind of weird ball to it. This right here, this object. Again, have a co close look at these. And this area here. Now, to me, there's more than one item sitting there. Okay. Now, again, I'm going to go back. To this you can still see them lines right there I did not change this this is there okay all right we got something on the ground here you can see this doing this what are the chances of this thing doing this okay looks like some kind of like platforms to walk up on something we've got these in the background here you can see it very faintly right here the straight lines in this photo alone scream intelligently made. In other words, you should not see the shapes and the things we're seeing in here. To be natural, I'm not buying it, guys. Okay? You can see what looks like things right under here. Now, I don't know what all of this mess is right here on top of it. See this? All this right here. This is all this mess. Whatever it is, it's probably centering because I can see these shapes in here. Right there. But again, this part here to me was just really intriguing. I'm not sure if this is more than one item or what this is. Again, the shadow on the bottom underneath this. We've got this weird shape like this. I don't know if you guys can see that. And all I'm doing is drawing the lines that are in here, guys. That's all I'm doing. See it coming down like this here. Almost matches that side. Got a line coming down here. I'm not sure what to make of this thing, but clearly this does not look natural. Let's put a little sharpening into it. Okay. Now, have a look at these lines in here now. I'm just going to bring it up a little further. All right. To me, guys, I'm not seeing anything natural down in the lower half here. Not seeing anything natural here. Nothing. 
these items up here. Of course, these have been sharpened, so they're kind of distorted now. But regardless of that, what do you guys think of that? Again, I can do this. And I'm seeing what looks like pieces laying all over the place here. I'm seeing this here. Not sure what to make of this. Maybe absolutely nothing. I can see another shape over here. See these right here? Not sure what to make of those, but they're kind of funky shapes. Now, there's no way of seeing this. This photo is almost impossible to get anything out of, truthfully. Okay? But as always, guys, what do you guys think of this? Put some blur back in. Okay? But I like to sharpen it up to see if we can find the lines. And again, guys, this was in the photo. I can do this right here. I can still see those parts in here. Again, pause it. Have a look with your magnifiers. Although it is a dark, very small photo and very low res, we can see things in there that doesn't quite look natural. And of course, you guys be the judge as always. If you guys like this photo, go ahead and hit the thumbs up. Greatly appreciated. Guys, drop your comments down below. Let me know what you think. Because every time I see something like this, I always look for something that's out of the norm. Something that doesn't look natural. And I think you guys will agree, once you see those lines and there's so many of them in a row, circles, lines, sometimes you can see straight edges and that's fine. That could be layered rock. When you start to see something like a small circle with a meaning detail, and, is, and whatever it is, is contoured around it, like it's shaped around it, like it's designed, you have to question that. Now, do we know what these objects are? No. They look like they're far off in the distance from just the photo, but there's no way to calculate or know just how far it is from this rover taking the photo, right? Or, sh or at least show you. Like, in other words, if you had the rover in the photo, you'd be able to tell right off the bat, right? Or at least have a good guesstimate. But we don't. But you can see these objects. Like I said, the one on the right just before the mounds... It clearly looks like it's got a shadow under it, like it has some kind of base holding it off the ground. Again, guys, tell me what you think. Have a good look at it, both the stock photo with your magnifier as well as the enhanced version, right? Guys, please like and share. Always appreciated. Let's get the word out. Seeing we're being uh, blacklisted and not being advertised, our channel's not being advertised, we need to do the footwork. Let's get this work out. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Always appreciated. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace, guys.